Developing tonight, a popular soccer coach is on life support. He was one of two innocent drivers shot in the south suburbs on Tuesday. The gunman still on the loose. CBS 2's Lauren Victory live in Robbins with more on this case. Lauren. Hi there, Rob. Well, I just checked in with the Cook County Sheriff's Office, who is the lead on this case. No updates, which means they're still trying to figure out who is responsible for injuring an Orland Park man at this intersection. And further down a ro the road, another man was left brain dead. He was just full of energy. The guy was like tireless. Friends of Bill Dolahide will tell you the very involved South Suburban dad was gunned down between his two loves. He was actually on his way home from games. He just finished up as a water polo referee and the Crestwood Soccer Club vice president was on his way to a soccer meeting when a bullet pierced his window on 135th Street in Robbins. We would never ever think that something so terrible would happen to him. The two sports communities are left stunned and scrambling to think of ways to remember the 56 year old. Having the uh, actual uniforms for the kids will have his initials printed on them. Some kind of memorial patch, something. Billy will not be forgotten. Our board shirts will have, we did good, because at the end of every uh, activity, he would always say, we did good, we did good. And Bill continues to do good. His organs will be used to save other lives. As friends wait on funeral arrangements, they're supporting his number one team, Flowers, already outside the married father of three's home this afternoon. And as a family attorney, do you have a message from them? Well, they are very um, appreciative of all the prayers. And the Dolahide family is now hoping for some donations. This GoFundMe page just sent to me by a family friend already almost $1,000 raised in less than an hour. I'm Lauren Victor reporting live in Robbins, CBS 2 News. Rob. Okay, Lauren, thank you.